What is up? I'm Moana Turtle, and today we're doing a Pokemon video. We have the new Japanese set. What is it called? Miracle Twins! <laughs> so, this set has a lot of cool stuff. Has the Mewtwo Mew tag team, which we're definitely searching for. Uh, but the one I want to get the most is that Dragonite GX. Um, that thing can just deal massive damage. I feel like it's really going to shake up the metagame when this does come out in Unified Minds. <clears throat> We're jumping right into it. There is some Pokemon that I'm not that familiar with still. <laughs> so I do have a checklist just to help me out. So we're going to open up half this box. As we don't want this video to be too long. And we did pick these up at Plaza Japan. It's kind of a, it's a pretty good site to get Japanese product. And um, But if you do want to get your own, you can find a link down below uh, for some uh, place on eBay that at this point where the thing is uh, released, um, you can get some good deals. Uh, this came in with the packages. Not sure what I'm looking at, but let's take a look. It's uh, some kind of little chick. Oh, it like moves around. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. Like if I imagine you put it on, like, on a pencil or something, and this thing kind of just like... Not exactly a bobblehead, but kind of same idea. So, pretty cool. We'll take it. <laughs> and we have our packs of Miracle Twins. I keep forgetting. I keep wanting to keep. Uh, I keep wanting to say uh, Unified Minds, but it's Miracle Twins. Let's go. Pack number one. Let's see how we can do on these. Let's see how much I need to cheat. Ah, oh, Kamala. So cute. Don't know much about this Pokemon uh, or this card, but he is super cute. And oh, this is one of the weird ones. This is Elgem. This looks like a straight up alien from a, uh, like a movie, <laughs> like a Pixar movie or something. We have a Joltik, a Purloin, and ooh, Misty's Request. I really want the full art of this. Uh, I think someone's comment for the Poke Beach uh, post was like, full art to this point are just being <laughs> like fan service, <laughs> which is, uh, I don't think I would really argue that point. <laughs> All right, that's pack number one. We got our first Misty's request. Really nice. Let's see what we can do in pack number two. An Araquanid, uh, Shroomish, Cottony, a um, Slaycoth. That's actually kind of weird looking. And then, uh, is this Sightseer, I think? So much better than the previous set. Oh, that was a lot, a lot of Pokemon I was not familiar with. Um, Joltik turns into Gravantula. No, nope, I should have known that one. Uh, Hone Edge, this weird sword thing. Onyx, I know that. Oh, that one only one energy attack for 20. Let's take a look at this. Maybe this thing's pretty good. Onyx, Bedrock Plus, press 20 damage during your opponent's next turn. Any damage to this stun is reduced by 20. That is terrible. Never mind. Uh, Swaddle into Swadloon, I think. And then this is the uh, Scrafty turns into something else. And he, yeah, that guy's weird. I don't feel bad about not knowing him. All right, let's keep going. Still yet to find our first big hit. Yeah, definitely what we want is Misty's Request, Dragonite GX, and the Mewtwo Mew. For, all right, Archeops, Carlos. 40 damage, switches Pokemon with one of your bench Pokemon, and then 80 damage, Hyper Beam, discard energy attached. Nope, oh, that's not good enough. <laughs> Wimpod. A Young Goose. Not a fan of this Pokemon. I Drillbur, I think. He looks so happy. And then, boom, there we go. Our first GX. We have an Aerodactyl. Prehistoric Wind. As long as your active Pokemon attacks to your, your opponent's basic Pokemon cost colorless more. Ah, that's pretty good. This is something you should just have on your bench, maybe. Although you do have to evolve it from Fossil, which is a huge, um, a big uh, minus. And, but yeah, just for all the tag teams, make them tax low cost more. Rock Smash 120 damage, that is super weak for three energy. And then Wild Die 50, 50 damage X, uh, 50 times the amount of energy attached to your opponent's Pokemon. That's pretty good. All right, there we go. Our first GX. Oops. All right, that's one hit in the bag. I'm glad we didn't waste our Seeker Rare on that. I think this is blue something. Why not? Why not? Um, Finian? Yes, Finian. Got it right. His attack is Gust. Not sure how he has Gust. 
Tauros classic. Hmm, that's a pretty cool art. And then Fung Boongoose, Fungus, something, some kind of fungus thing. It's weird how his his head and his hands look like Pokeballs. I'm not sure how that's supposed to be useful. All right, uh, Lipard, Scorupi. Finally evolved my Scorupi in Pokemon Go. Uh, another Swaddle, a Oranguru. Interesting art. And then Slay King. This is very cartoony looking. Okay, Strikes Back. If, you poke, if this active Pokemon takes damage, put four. Wow, it's kind of like a counter from a champ, but only does four damage. That's pretty good. 180, though. Uh, I'm not sure if he'll survive many. And then for four colorless, you can use that triple acceleration. Dynamic Swing, 100 plus, you do 100 more damage. You may do 100 more damage if you do your points X turn. This Pokemon takes 100 more damage. Interesting. Uh, it's kind of a high cost. If that was just like one DC, that would be amazing. All right, moving on, we have uh, Exadrill, I think. Kind of weird art. Reminds me of uh, at the end of Incredibles, that thing that comes out. <laughs> Dual Blade, Fungus, Noibat. And then, ah, uh, Whimsicott. I really like Whimsicott. He is super cute. Executor. Ah, it's been a while since we've seen the good old Executor, not the Alolan one. A random sword. Another swaddle. Unidentified fossil. These things keep. The HP keeps going up. Then <laughs> fossil. Original fossils, like 10 HP. Now they're up to 60. And then Tapu Coco. I feel like Tapu Coco has so many prints that are non GX compared to. Uh, I guess actually, no. The other Guardians also have as well. I take it back. Gumshoes. Reminds me of uh, the detective game. Tynamo. Yanma. It's Dragonfly. Ooh, what was this one called? This is a Basculin. Let's see what this thing does. Group Devour. This attack does 20 damage times the number of Basculin you have in play to one of your opponent's bench Pokemon. Ooh, so if you have a bunch of them, 120 for one Colos? That's not bad. Tackle 10 da- Wait, what? 10 damage? This thing says 20. All right, and then, ooh, Steelix. 170. Steelix usually, oh, yep, he always has ridiculous energy costs. Which I feel kind of bad because it makes, makes it so he's never very viable. Alright, Steelix. Land stream, 20 damage. Attach two fighting energy from discard Pokemon. Card piled to this Pokemon. That's pretty good. You use that, and then next turn you can use this. Uh, Giga Shake, 220 damage. None of your none of your Pokemon can attack during your next Oh boy. Alright, forget it. Not worth it. If it was like he couldn't attack, then that'd that'd be very cool. Then you can just swap them out. Do it again. Alright. No idea what that is. Execute a Vicaroth. Oh yes, Tortuga. This is the one I really wanted. A super cute turtle. Not very strong, but we'll take it. And ooh, there it is. There's our tag team. Oh man, this is the um this texture. This must be the alternate art. Okay, there we go. Our first alternate art for our Japanese openings. And it looks amazing. All right, we just pulled. Hopefully, our not our only. I think that I consider. Yeah, no. Seeker rare, Sableye and Tyranitar tag team. Let's take a look for darkness. For darkness plus a colorless greed crash. 210 damage. If your opponent's active Pokemon is a GX or EX Pokemon, is knocked out by damage. Take one more prize card. Okay. And then Giga Fall. 250. If you're if you have five additional energy, five. Jeez. Um, Discard 15 cards to attack your opponent's deck. Uh, okay. Hmm. Not sure. I feel like these costs are way too high. But a really cool card right there. And possibly our secret rare. And we still have a bunch of packs left. Come on. Still want that Misty's. Still want that Dragonite. Well, I'm really happy. I love that art. We have a cute little Lapras with Misty in the background. Uh, Scrafty? 
a Connie Dragonair. There he is. There we need a. Uh, this thing is really terrifying. Rickoloth or something like that. I feel like this guy's supposed to evolve or something. Or he should have an evolution, but I don't think he does. At least not in this set. All right. Really strong opening so far. No idea what this little ball is. A purloin electrike. This fish turns into his terrifying eel thing. Dedene. And then, is that a Yveltal? I am, where is his head? Is his head, is it like that? Is... Okay, pretty weird art for Yveltal. Ah, all right, so we so far we got a, a cool Aerodactyl, a sweet turtle Tortuga, and a Sableye Tyranitar. All right, this rock alien thing, Dratini, and then Leaf. Leafini or something like that. He looks kind of weird. All right, we have two more packs for this first part of this box. Come on, let's get one more hit. Um, Eljum turns into he turns into Pihim. That's kind of weird. Uh, side punch, twenty damage. Mysterious noise, ninety damage. Shuffle this Pokemon all cards attached into your deck. Yeah, but pony can't play any item cards. That's kind of cool, the item card thing, but the rest of it's kind of terrible. Yeah, Mega, Drillbur, um, Finian turns into Shinian or something like that. Then Sableye. I feel like they often have like the individuals from the tag teams in the sets as well. All right, last pack. Can we have some last pack magic? We have a Breloom. Interesting, he has two grass attacks. A Slick Slackoff. Shroomish, Wimpod, and I don't know your name. You, you are weird looking. All right, so there we go, guys. We have a monster opening to start. We have the Aerodactyl GX. I feel like his power is quite good. A Sableye Tyranitar alternate art. The texture is kind of weird. And, oh, look at that. This awesome little turtle. Super cute. The thing he evolves into is quite ugly, so I really like this card and don't care for much for his evolution. Uh, but there you guys have it. Um, yeah, let me know what your thoughts are on this set. And yeah, if you want to pick up your own box, you can find like an eBay link down below. Uh, it'll be like the best deal I could find for this, uh, for one of these boxes. Um, but yeah, thanks for watching. Let me know what your thoughts are on this set. Like, comment, and subscribe all down below. I'm a one turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.